Oh, oh my. Little Bella was born on March 12th, 2018. She definitely keeps us on our toes. <laughs> when she was born, she not only blessed her parents, but a hundred others in need of healing. Bella and her mom, Catherine, donated birth tissue through units. <laughs> is that what you think about it? <laughs> what we're doing is taking cells from that placenta or amnion, which is another portion of the placenta or the umbilical cord that can be used in burn victims, eye victims, some other healing processes. Most commonly it's used in ocular and dental procedures as well as in conjunction with skin grafts for burn victims. It also has uh, uses to repair tendons and nerves. It has uses in spinal um, cord injuries. I thought that's such a great idea. I mean, you're not doing anything with the placenta and that it can help a hundred lives in you know different ways. That's absolutely amazing. Any mother with a scheduled C-section is eligible to donate the problem is, not many know it. I think there's a lot of people who have no idea that this is an option for them. I didn't realize you could donate your placenta. Unit says the process is simple, involving some paperwork and a phone call. When I went in to have the C-section, uh, the technician came in, did the paperwork with me. They actually even gave us a crocheted blanket for the baby, um, and it was super easy. Otherwise, the placenta would simply be discarded. But. The word is spreading. If you think about, you know, doing 30 donations a month, up to 100 different graphs from each donation, we're, we're impacting the lives of countless people. <laughs> and at the young age of one, Bella has no idea the number of people she has already helped. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.